Hello everyone, this is Teacher Juvie and I will be your guide for today's lesson. Okay, so let's talk about adding similar fractions and similar mixed fractions without and with regrouping. Okay, so here are the rules in adding similar fractions. When we say similar fractions, they have the same denominator. So we add the numerator first, copy the same denominator, and simplify if possible. So let's try to add similar fractions. So let's have this example. Add 3 over 6 plus 1 over 6. So they are similar fractions since they have the same denominator. So what is the rule in adding similar fractions? Okay. So unang rule, you are going to add the numerators. Ano yung numerator? 3 and 1. So 3 plus 1 is equal to 4. Diba? So, add the numerator, 3 plus 1, and copy the same denominator, which is 6. After mo i-add yung numerator, kukopihin nyo lang yung kanyang parehong denominator. So, 6. Then, we will have 4 over 6. Ang 4 over 6 ay pwede pang i-express sa lowest term. Ano nga ang hahanapin natin para ma-express natin ang fraction sa lowest term? We are going to find the GCF of 4 and 6. So, tinuro ko na nakaraan. Kung gamit tayo ng continuous division, so, 4 and 6, saan divisible ang 4 at 6? We can divide them by 2. 4 divided by 2 is 2. And 6 divided by 2 ay 3. Okay, so, meron pa ba? Pwede pa ba natin i-divide ang 2 at 3? So, wala na. Therefore, and GCF niya is 2. So, we will divide the numerator and the denominator by the GCF na 2. To get the lowest term. So, ang answer natin ngayon, 4 divided by 2 is 2. And 6 divided by 2 is 3. So, this is now the final answer or the lowest term. 2 over 3. So let's now proceed with addition of similar mixed fraction. So we just add the whole number and the fractions, then combine and simplify if possible. We have an example of adding uh, mixed, mixed similar fractions. So, magaya din siya ng pag-a-add ng similar fraction. Ang pagkakaiba lang nito ay meron itong uh, whole number. So, first thing na una natin gagawin ay ang i-add mo natin ang mga whole number. So, whole number sa whole number, numerator sa numerator, then happy the same denominator. So, add 4 plus 2. 4 plus 2. Then, ano ba yung same yung denominator? Diba? 10. Copy the same denominator. And then, 5 plus 3 ay add the numerator. Uh, add the numerator. So, 5 plus 3. So, the answer is 4 plus 2 is 6. And 5 plus 3 is 8. Copy 10. Then, tingnan yung fraction. Yung final answer, tingnan nyo kung pwede pa siyang i-lowest term. So, meron pa siyang lowest term. Hahanapin natin ang GCF ng 8 at 10. So, gamit lang tayo ng continuous division to find the GCF. So, this is the greatest common factor. So, 8 and 10 is divisible by 2. So, the answer is 4. Then, divide sa 2 is 5. Therefore, the GCF is 2. We divide the numerator and the denominator by the GCF 2 to find the lowest term. So, 6. 8 divided by 2 is 4. Then, 10 divided by 2 is 5. So, the answer now is 6 and 4 feet.
like if you learn from this video and don't forget to subscribe on my channel thank you so much